Not sure what this is, but I better check it out. It isn't Goku. I'd better look for more. Where the hell could he be? Unlike anything I've ever felt before. Well, now, this could be fun. I'm ready whenever you are. Let's do this. This will end it. Don't kid yourself. You could never beat me. Well now, this could be fun. I'm ready whenever you are. Let's do this! So that's all, huh? is incredible.
Well now, this could be fun. I'll make quick work of you. Don't kid yourself, you could never beat me. Well now, this could be fun. Well now, this could be fun. Well now, this could be fun. Looks like there's water here. Well now, this could be fun. Well now, this could be fun. I'll make quick work of you. Don't kid yourself, you could never beat me. Well now, this could be fun. That's some clear water. Well now, this could be fun. Well now, this could be fun. Well now, this could be fun. I'll make quick work of you. So that's all, huh?
is incredible. Hmm. Looks like someone wants to die. Someone wants to die. Is that some sort of cave? Looks to be a lot of room in that cave. I'm ready whenever you are. Let's do this! Tick, 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 tick.
Well now, this could be fun. I'm ready whenever you are. Let's do this! This could be fun. Well now, this could be fun. Someone wants to die. I've got no use for these people. You looking for something? Feel free to browse. Come back real soon. Hey. 
Hello there. See you later. This could be fun. like someone wants to die. Well now, this could be fun. Someone wants to die. like someone wants to die. Well now, this could be fun. Huh. Huh. <laughs> Looks like someone wants to die. Well now, this could be fun. I'll make quick work of you. Never beat me. What? 
See a windmill up ahead. Someone wants to die. Hmm. Looks like someone wants to die. A steel bridge, huh? Hmm. Looks like someone wants to die. <laughs> Looks like someone wants to die. <gasps> What's going on? Chee, so it wasn't Kakarot after all. Who the hell are you? I don't have time to waste with you. Wait a minute. This is a Namekian, isn't it? What the hell is a Namekian doing on this planet? If that's true, then what are you even doing here? You got a death wish? <laughs> You've got spunk. I like that. Hmm. A power level of 322, huh? You're definitely stronger than the others. But you wouldn't even be a warm-up for me. You're making a mistake in underestimating me. Let's see if you can make this fun for me. Just one more with this guy. That was pathetic. That was pathetic. No way! That was pathetic. That all, huh? Is it my turn now? Time to show you what real power looks like. <laughs> I'm getting another large power reading. That's got to be Kakarot! <clears throat> Im impossible! 
Who the hell is this guy? And where is he going? <laughs> well, if it isn't Kakarot, you've grown. You look just like our old man. What? Tell me, Kakarot, what is this? You were supposed to exterminate all life on this planet. What have you been doing all this time? Huh? Who are you? And who's Kakarot? Should I know who that is? You have got to be kidding me. You don't remember. Fine then, allow me to refresh your memory. You're not from this filthy planet. You were born on planet Vegeta. You're a member of the proud and mighty warrior race, the Saiyans. And that's not all. I'm your older brother, Raditz. You're lying! That can't be true! Long ago, you were sent to this pathetic planet to rid it of all life! We say and search the universe for habitable planets and wipe out all who live there so that we can sell those planets to the highest bidder. Weak, snot-nosed brats like you are sent to low-level planets like this. And fortunately, it looks like this one's got a moon. Uh, if this guy's telling the truth, then these Saiyans are some real bad dudes. Wait, what about the moon? What does that have to do with anything? Don't play dumb with me. We Saiyans release our true power whenever there's a full moon. Even chumps like you should know that. Eh? I don't know what you're talking about. You know... I think Krillin's right. You guys are the worst. My name's Son Goku, and I'm from Earth. Take your lies and get out of here. <laughs> well, I couldn't even if I wanted to. Because Planet Vegeta was blown to smithereens by a meteor. Almost all of our brethren have been turned to space dust now. Uh... Including me? And you, there are only four Saiyans left. Just the other day, we found a planet that should fetch us a high price. The three of us were going to have a hell of a time trying to overtake it. And that's when I remembered you. Kakarot. The planet is as good as ours if you join us. Come on, Kakarot! Think of the fun we'll have! Isn't your Saiyan blood boiling with excitement? Just shut up! If you think I'm joining you, then you're dumber than you look! Huh. Fine. Be that way. That little runt with the tail behind you is your kid, right? I guess I'll just take him instead. Huh? Come any closer and I'll knock you sky high! Back off! <laughs> oh, yeah? Well, go ahead if you think you can. Gohan's not going anywhere with you! Uh, what the hell with this guy? You're not my brother. You're nothing to me! What's wrong? Yeah, go on, get out of here! Hacker, oh, don't turn your back on your family, your people! <laughs> what the hell happened to your tail? I had it cut off a long time ago! Ooh, why would you do that? Yeah. Do you know what? This guy is in our back. I think it could serve as our next target. The three of us Saiyans should be able to rid this place of its dead weight in just one month.
Don't worry, Catcoat. I'll make sure to take good care of the boy. If you want him back, then you better do as your big brother says. Give him back! And don't even think about trying to be a hero. <laughs> You still got that dragon radar? Oh, I get it! That decoration on Gohan's hat was a dragon ball! All right, I'm off! It's now or never! You're as good as dead on your own! Piccolo! Neither of us has what it takes to face him head on. At least if we tried on our own. But together, if we were to team up, we just might be able to take him down. Yeah, you're probably right. But can I really trust you? What's your angle in all this? Don't get the wrong idea. It isn't that I care in the slightest about your little kid or the Earth. That fool is the only thing standing between me and world domination. The moment he and his cronies are out of the picture. I'd finally rid myself of you. Then the world will be mine for the taking. You're crazy if you think I'm about to let that happen. But for now, I guess we gotta join forces. Guess there's really no getting around that. Precisely. a little longer. Goku, get a move on. Quit messing around. You really don't recall anything about the Saiyans that Raditz clown was going on about? Nope. None of it rings a bell. It's crazy. I had no idea I had an older brother either. <laughs> I was hoping to milk some useful information out of you for our fight.
can go faster. This thing's giving off a lot of energy. <laughs> I can tell this thing's got lots of energy. Can go faster.
Nice weather. That bridge is massive! His tail's probably his weak point. If we can squeeze his tail, he should be vulnerable. That's what happened whenever mine got grabbed. How are we supposed to grab his tail? This thing's giving off a lot of energy. Better check the map.
now. Yeah! Excuse me. Yeah. Thank you. 
No. <laughs> All right. Can I count on you? What? What do you think? <laughs> oh my! <laughs> hmm. Thank you. Yeah! See ya! Goodbye.
this a power level of 710 where the hell kakarot's kid no way damn this thing must be busted what another reading and it's heading straight for me there's one no there's two with power levels 322 and 334 they've come so, what brings you chumps here? Isn't it obvious? I'm here to get my son back. Where is he? You're hiding him somewhere, aren't you? His screaming was giving me a headache, so I locked him up in there. But forget about the runt. Don't tell me you actually think you stand a chance against me. You fool! You're not even fit to call yourself a Saiyan! Prepare to die! combined power, you're still pathetic. But considering you weren't smart enough to heed my warning, don't deserve to live. You, you gotta be kidding me! You know what, since you're going to die anyway, I might as well tell you something. The two Saiyans I mentioned earlier, they're even more powerful than me.
If you've got a new attack hidden up your sleeve, now's the time to use it, Goku! <laughs> Sorry. I'm fresh out. <laughs> Lucky for you, I actually came up with a new technique while I was training. Really? A plan? Ha! It'd be easier just to lie down and wait for the sweet release of death. I'm just gonna need enough time to charge up the proper energy for it. <clears throat> gonna need you to keep him busy while I deal with this. Got it. I'll do what I can. Hope you're ready for this. Special Beam Cannon! Huh. You just don't know when to quit. My power! Whoa! 
just because you're my little brother. Yes! Yes, that's what I like to hear! It'll all be over soon! <laughs> Don't get comfortable! You're next! Damn, if I try to hit him now, he's just going to dodge it! Just were. <laughs> I, I, I can't believe that Kakarot would just throw away his own life. You idiot. Trust me, Goku won't be dead for very long. What? Didn't you know? This planet is home to the Dragon Balls. They grant wishes. Absolutely any wish imaginable. Even bringing someone back from the dead. Uh, damn it. Well, my comrades will be happy to hear that. 
<laughs> Everything you just said was transmitted to them on the other side of the universe. Once they've learned that I've died, they will come here. How long until then? When, when will they... When do you think they'll get here? Uh, a year. Just one year from now. <laughs> Damn it. One year before even stronger warriors arrive. You two... have no hope of beating them. Enjoy. What little time you have left. <laughs> I... I see. That's pretty much it. Come on, Goku! Hang in there! It's not like you to give up so easily! Trillin, you know... Dying... is a lot worse than I thought it would be. Uh, yeah, but... Don't you worry! We're gonna bring you back really soon! <laughs> Thank you. <sighs> Goku! What the? He's gone! Interesting. I bet Kami has something to do with this. Eh? Huh? Well, I guess we can put our minds at ease if Kami's involved. You guys need to get the Dragon Balls. Kami doesn't possess the power needed to bring someone back to life. Also, Goku's kid will be coming with me for the time being. What? Uh, you, you're kidding, right? What are you gonna do with him? With a little training and the right teacher, that kid could be capable of serious power. We're going to need all the power we can get before those two Saiyans show up in a year's time. Me training this little runt is our best shot to stand a chance. Once Goku's revived, Tell him he'll get his son back and in better shape than he left him. Meanwhile, on a planet far, far from Earth. Raditz, the bastard went and got himself killed. He always was an embarrassment. Still, I must admit, I'm very interested in these Dragon Balls. So they're capable of granting any wish? All right, let's go. We're gonna bring Raditz back from the dead? Don't make me laugh. We have no more use for that dead weight. We could wish for eternal youth. For immortality, can you imagine it? Nothing could possibly stand in our way. Sounds good to me. Count me in! Invigorated by the prospect of attaining immortality with the Dragon Balls, the two Saiyans made their way to Earth. And that is why I brought him here as he is, to be trained further. Therefore, if it is agreeable to you, King Yama, I humbly ask that you allow him to meet with King Kai. Hmm, I see. So you intend to take this heaven-bound soul? 
and subject him to the grueling 625,000 mile long snake way so he can meet King Kai. Indeed. Very well. If you wish to see King Kai, then I suggest you be on your way. However, I should warn you that no one has ever, ever made it successfully, other than myself, of course, in over 100 million years. Must be one heck of a journey. I better get started. By the way, did a guy named Raditz come through here? Yes, we've got him marked down for hell, of course. Did he put up much of a fight? <laughs> he sure did. He definitely didn't go quietly, but I sorted him out. Whoa! You must be one heck of a strong guy! So, you were sent along with him, huh? I am the great King Yemma. I occupy a position above that of the Earth's Guardian. Do you know what that means? That means you're crazy strong, right? You don't seem to understand what I'm saying. Of course I'm strong! But it's not just my strength that serves me in this position. You need brains to do this kind of managerial work. Mana, mana what work? Now then, to help you better understand my work, let's give you a little quiz. Uh, well, um, actually kind of in a hurry. Well then, if that's going to be your attitude, then I guess you don't need to see King Kai. Oh, what? No way! Okay, okay, I'll take the quiz. Why didn't you say that from the beginning? Anyway, let's begin. I'll let you through if you can answer all of my questions correctly. That's right. He made a mess of enough planets to earn himself a place in hell. In fact, he's one of the biggest pains we've ever had to deal with. Right, next question. Correct, of course I am. I am much more powerful. Isn't that right, Kami? Ah, yes, King Yem. You are more powerful. Right, next question. That's right. No matter where they're from, all who die come here. Like your brother. He wasn't an Earthling. Next question. Not bad. That's correct. Those pesky Dragon Balls are indeed how you do it. I hate those things. It's like my job doesn't even matter. Who created those blasted balls anyway? Care to shed some light on that, Kami? Oh, uh, King Yama, I... <sighs> Whatever. Moving on. Sorry, but that's incorrect. Huh? What? This is the fifth question, right? Really? Um, one, two, three... Hmm... Of course it was, I... I was just testing you. And you passed the test. Well, that was the true fifth question. There's that trademark denial of his. Hmm... I heard that, Kami! Maybe I'll send you to hell when it's your time. Oh, please forgive me, your highness. Boy, he's got one hell of a sense of hearing. <laughs> oh, you think you're some sort of funny man. Hm. That's enough of all this. I will allow you to see King Kai. Wow, really? Thanks a bunch, Mr. Yemma. Don't tell me you've forgotten who you're talking to! No, 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 Mr. I'm King Yemma. I haven't! <laughs> That's more like it. If you're going to see King Kai, then go. Well, this is where we part ways. 
Good luck, Goku. Thanks. I'm not really sure what to expect, but I'm pumped to meet this King Kai guy. Time to wake up, kid. You've slept long enough. Huh? Who, who are you? Listen up. Time for a reality check. Your daddy is dead, okay? He sacrificed himself to kill the man who kidnapped you, in case you forgot. His friends are vigilant and able to find the Dragon Balls. They can bring him back. However, we've got other things to deal with. Though we were able to defeat Raditz, it sounds like we've got two of his buddies to worry about a year from now. If that's really the case, your father and I probably aren't going to be enough to take these guys down. We need power. Your power. You're going to have to learn to fight and defend the Earth. Gohan's Crash Course in Survival. B but I, 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 I'm no, I'm no good at fighting. Quit your whining. Once I'm done whipping you into shape, you'll be tough enough for anything. Got it? So, y you're gonna train me? Okay, what do I have to do? You have to live out here on your own, without distraction. I'm giving you six months. If you're able to survive for that long, I'll teach you how to fight. See ya.